Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to my channel. Today we will learn point slope form of equation of a straight line. In the previous video, we discussed slope intercept form of equation of a straight line. Now we have two things. One is point. The other one is slope. The theorem says equation of a non-vertical straight line this which we labeled as L with slope m. The slope of this line is m and passing through a point q x1 y1. Suppose this line is passing through a point which we labeled as q x1 y1 is y minus y1 is equals to m x minus x1. So it means if we have one point given and one slope given then the formula to find an equation is y minus y1 is equals to m x minus x1. How we can derive this form? Let this p be any arbitrary point. Let p whose coordinates are x comma y be any arbitrary point of the straight line L with slope m as I said earlier the slope of this line is m okay and passing through a point and this line is passing through a point Q whose coordinates are x1, y1. Now as this P and Q lie on a same line. So the slope is given as M which is equals to y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1. So we have two points q and p. This is x1, y1. This is x2 and y2. So applying the formula m is equals to y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1. So this factor is in the deviant form. Taking it to the other side of equality, it will multiply. This is x minus x1 which is equals to y minus y1. So y minus y1 is equals to m x minus x1. So this is how we can prove this. This is an equation of a straight line passing through x1 y1 with slope m. So example number one is write down an equation of a straight line passing through 5 comma 1 and parallel to a line passing through the points 0 comma minus 1 and 7 comma minus 15. So it means we have a straight line. Suppose this is passing through point 5 comma 1. Suppose. And suppose we have another line which is passing through these two coordinates and these two lines are parallel to each other. Now what we have to do is with the help of these points which are 5 comma 1 and these two points we will write an equation for this line. Okay this is 5 comma 1 let it label as x1 y1. Now since we are dealing with a topic which says we want one point and one slope. So we have got the point. The thing which is missing is slope. So with the help of these two points we can easily find slope. This is 0 comma minus 1 and 7 comma minus 15. So the formula of slope m is equals to minus 15 minus minus 1 divided by 7 minus 0. So m is equals to minus 15 minus minus plus 1 divided by 7. 
which is equals to minus 15 plus 1 minus 14 divided by 7. 7 1 times 7 and 2 times is 14. So m is equals to minus 2 is the slope. Now we have got the point as well as the slope. Now we can easily form an equation which is y minus y1 is equals to m x minus x1 y minus the value of y1 is 1 which is equals to the value of slope is minus 2 x minus x1 is 5 okay y minus 1 is equals to minus 2 into x minus 2x minus minus plus 2 5 times is 10 so y minus 1 this plus 2x and minus 10x is equals to 0. Simplifying 2x plus y minus 10 minus 1 is equals to minus 11 which is equals to 0. So 2x plus y minus 11 is equals to 0 is an equation of the required line. Example number 2. Find an equation of the line through minus 8, 5 having slope undefined. The slope in this question is undefined. So m is equals to infinity. It means we can suppose the value of infinity. So it means we can suppose the value of m to be 1 divided by 0. And slope and points we have are minus 8 comma 5 which is equals to x1 comma y1. So the formula of point slope equation is y minus y1 is equals to m x minus x1. So y minus y1 is equals to 5 which is equals to the value of m is 1 divided by 0. x minus x1 is minus 8. So y minus 5 which is equals to 1 over 0 x minus minus is plus this is 8. Now this 0 when it will move to the other side of equality it will multiply which is equals to 1 x plus 8. So 0 multiplication with this factor will give us 0 which is equals to 1 x times is x plus 1 8 times is 8. So x plus 8 is equals to 0 or we can say x is equals to minus 8. So this is an equation of the required line. Last example we have is find an equation of the line when y intercept is minus 7 and slope is minus 5. So y intercept is minus 7 it means 0 comma minus 7 because this is how we write the value of y intercept. x is 0 in this case and the value of y is written. So this is equals to x1 comma y1 and the value of slope is given which is minus 5. So as we know the equation is y minus y1 which is equals to m x minus x1. So y minus y1 is minus 7 equals the value of m is minus 5 x minus the value of x1 is 0 so y minus minus plus 7 which is equals to minus 5 x minus 0 is x so y plus 7 is equals to minus 5x y plus 5x plus 7 is equals to 0 which is an equation of the required 
लाइन